Hello friends, Marcy here. It's a goulet kind of day. Um, I was actually expecting this on tracking uh, tomorrow, Thursday. Um, actually, the last two goulet orders I've placed, um, it seems like the tracking has been slower than the package, um, or the tracking information has been slower than the package, because I ordered this um, last Friday, and um, I checked on Monday and I still didn't have traffic tracking updates. And then finally the tracking updates came through on Tuesday with expected delivery on Thursday and it arrived on Wednesday. So the, the tracking or the package is actually moving faster than the tracking. So there we go. And no complaints. I, I love having my packages earlier than expected. Um, so real quick course the lolly oh that's a red 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 lollipop red 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 tootsie pop um oh my gotta take those to the grandkids they're piling up um and this package was packaged with a slightly ridiculous amount of care by armand thank you armand i appreciate it so i got my oh you know what this is a perfect this is the perfect sticker for this package and I'll show you why in a quick minute. Wow, I'm impressed. That was like, y'all did that to me on purpose and I appreciate it. So um, this is just another quick sample. I'm behind on swatching. I've, I've got a swatch. Um, this sample, which is the, the diamine, 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 all those names I've heard pronounced. <laughs> I've heard them all, but the one I choose to use is a Diamine uh, Purple Pizzazz. And I ordered this um, because I saw another friend, um, Roberta, use this in um, her video and I loved it. It's like, okay, I'm on it. And so I put ad added it to my order as a sample. I'm gonna try it out and more than likely, I'm gonna get the big bottle. I've got so many big bottles. I've um, mentioned to myself, let's see if myself will listen, that I need to start ordering more samples and less bottles. But I just, I find a, an ink that looks gorgeous and there you go. Well, I may as well have the full thing. Oh my goodness, my first Bennu pen. We're gonna get into this and I'll show you why that ink swatch sticker is so special. Um, so, okay, okay, oh, I heard something rattle. It's not taped, but it is, there we go. This box has a nice texture, wow. It's um, got a grip to it, but it, yet yeah, it's smooth. I like that. It reminds me of the cover on the Wonderland 222 um, planners and notebooks. And inside, the foiled name inside a little cardboard envelope which is oh my goodness it's pretty <laughs> it's pretty see what did I tell you about that sticker what did I tell you about that sticker being perfect for this order all right and this is called the Bennu um, luminous orchid and when you hear the name luminous you know that thing will illuminate yeah but I have to charge it in the daylight it needs some daylight hours so I'm gonna charge it by some sunlight and I will try to get back to you and let you see it illuminate in the dark it's a glow-in-the-dark pen can you believe it yes okay some of you are, already have yours and yes you can believe it but for those of you who do not have yours I'm about to shock you about to shock your socks. Okay, so um, when I ordered the venue, I actually wanted, I was debating. I want wanted both, but I was debating between this one and the Milky Way. And because of the illumination, I ordered this one. So the Milky Way remains on my wish list. Okay, that's quite a long cartridge there. Um, it comes with the cartridge. Let's see what else is in here. Lots of paperwork, things to read on information and lifetime warranty. So 
and get into that and find out what I need to know with some little shredded um, paper worms for protection. So let's move this out of the way. I'm going to move this as well because um, although I appreciate it, I uh, plan, to or plan to use um, some of the ink I ordered, the purpose of ordering that. So I'm going to leave that there just because you need to see it. Um, all right, so we're going to look inside. Oh, and by the way, um, this cap does not post um, for the reason you see all the different diamond facets that are here and here and here and here and here and here. So the, there's no way for that to um, post, and I'm fine with that. So um going to look inside look at all that gorgeous glitter of course to me in person I can really see the the 3d it's much more gorgeous than it is on camera and I apologize for that because I'm enjoying it more than you are right now um so we'll look inside that plastic and that is um that is a generous um converter there it's uh, I'm used to my pilot vanishing point and my Kaweco converters which are so tiny on their capacity so I'm appreciating this one and I'm going to be inking that with my sample of the Damien purple bazaz today um, because oh do you see that I don't know if yeah you can see that shimmer um, it's the reason I ordered it because it has the shimmer but one thing I'm, I noticed that the shimmer is actually gold. And my shimmer in the pen is silver. So that's why I ordered a sample. I want to try it out and see how that's working for me. And I might find something more suitable because I do like my pens to, my glitter to match the, body or barrel of my pens and I think that's why I like um, the demonstrator barrels so much because it doesn't matter what color I put in there I can change the pen with the color of ink that I'm using and I, I really enjoy that so um, we are on I can't show you the luminous part but I can show you maybe the nib part and did I get okay I got a medium so the M is right in the middle of a circle. Oh, I'm in the glare. A gorgeous decorative nib, by the way. And it says Schmidt. And there are more letters down there that I can't see right now. So I'll have to look them up. Anyway, I want to put some ink in here and put this pen to paper and, and let you have some fun with me. Um, but to do that, I do know that I have to distribute some of my sparkles. Oh, look at there. Some of my sparkles in this ink. So I'm going to distribute them slowly here. Um, open my pen back up. Distribute once more before I actually dip and fill. Okay. I'm having fun. Sorry, y'all. All right. Um... Once before I do that, I just want to make sure that I've secured that converter back to where it belongs. And all right, here we go. Have fun with me, y'all, as I ooh, look at that bubble. Isn't it pretty? <laughs> it's a pretty bubble. It's got iridescent properties. Wow. Okay, I'm about to burst my bubble. There we go. All right, I'm going to fill my, um, okay, here we go. All right, and I know I got some bubbles in there at the last, but I'm not gonna worry about it because if I need to get every last drop out of this uh, sample vial, I can do that with my um, syringe, so. All right, we have put this back together, do a little bit of cleanup. Not much because it actually came out of the 
they're looking pretty well. And I always get inky on my fingers, but I don't mind. So one thing about this pen, and I knew it before purchasing it, is that it does not post. So the length of the pen in my hand is, that's all we get. And I'm fine with that. Um, it's a, a good size for me, the way I hold my pen and where it rests. Um, so let's put some ink on paper and we'll look at this. I gotta let it charge in this um, sunlight real quick. So we have, ooh, loving the purple already. And the reason I ordered this pen is I was actually, I don't have many purple things. And I was, um, oh wait, what's this other name? Briolet, I believe. The new Briolet. Oh, it's so pretty. I'm talking about the ink, but yeah, the pen's pretty too. <laughs> okay, and this is a medium nib. I was half thinking I ordered the broad. Just half thinking that, I don't know. But, ooh, this pen, I mean, this ink is so pretty already. Let's get closer. Now, see in the camera, it's looking like dark black to me. Um, this Narwhal um, Tools to Live by Ink is brown. And I'm sorry that what you're seeing here does look black, but it is really pretty um deep deep purple um here on the page i wonder if i get closer and we'll let it dry and see what happens of course we have the, the shimmers in there that um i hope were worked around uh, before i put it in there but we have um the diamine purple pizzazz and i'm gonna say thank you again roberta for um, sharing this on your channel at Life with Intention. I will look that up to make sure that's correct. Um, I love this. So um, look at the little shimmer. I don't know if you can see the shimmers floating around in the ink here. I'm out of focus right there on top. There we go. Um, so I ordered this for this pen on purple because of the pizzazz, because of the shimmer. And um, anxious for it to arrive. As I said, I'm I'm ordering um, purples because I don't have many purple things. Um, but my I've changed schools and districts, and my new um, my new schools purple uh, color is main color is purple. So I've been ordering purple binders, purple clothes, purple pens, and purple ink um, to accentuate everything that I'm doing because I have to have fun and I think this glow in the dark pen is going to be fabulous and fun for the kiddos um, in the classroom because I like to have lights off quite often with um, lamp light when appropriate but our lights are um, you flip the switch and when you walk into the room it's still dark for a while because they're motion sensor lights and so it takes a minute for them to come on and I'm just thinking about all the chances that I'm going to have for this um, pen to illuminate once it charges so let me I don't know it's been in the box for probably days and weeks but let me shut my window blinds turn off my desk light here and my room light we'll see if there's any kind of illumination yet oh faintly I can faintly see a blue illumination here of course I'm getting some light from my phone but faintly I can see it um, from across the room and I will share that more with you later when it happens so lights back on because I'm going to say goodbye for now and let you know that I am behind on swatching inks so this will be this new ink will be added to my swatch book um, along with um, the inks that came with my last uh, purchase from Goulet, the Sailor uh, bundle, and I will share this more in detail with you soon. I have not unpacked that to do any kind of review with you. And then the last um, Robert Schwartz, uh, Robert Oster uh, Schwartz Rose that I had added as a sample to my order. It's out of focus. Anyway, I have, oh, and then this theming Golden Sands. I have a lot more to share with y'all. I'm just behind y'all. I'm sorry. Um, 
I've been working in my classroom every day this week. I know it's only July, the middle of July, but that's what we do. We gotta be prepared, be ready, so we don't have so much um, happening at the last minute, which the last minute is coming fast approaching. So, thank you for spending some of your precious moments with me. Oh my goodness, you have a blessed day. Bye-bye.